Hello everyone, Love King here, and welcome back to episode 2 of Mod Trilogy, where we take a look at three mods that were just released for Skyrim on Xbox, and if you haven't already done so, don't forget to check out our growing Discord community server, which is full of the most helpful, knowledgeable modders, a few mod authors as well, and the most amazing screen captures I have ever seen. Now with that being said, let's get straight into the video. If you were ever looking for a really good fantasy setup and didn't want to piecemeal them together with mod A plus mod B and C, then look no further as we will be taking a look at Through the Looking Glass Flora by Yara Balin. I'm currently running the Flora version as it combines both the tree versions and the grass plant version as well. And together they come out to be a whopping 198.3 megabytes, which if you ask me, is still a great deal for the visual quality this mod produces. You will really get the best of both worlds when using this mod as it gives off a really cool Alice in Wonderland look and feel with a pinch of Shivering Isles vibe from Oblivion. Truly this is an amazing fantasy flora overhaul that I'm really impressed with and I believe you all should give this mod a try and install it for yourselves. After being in Fantasyland, why not grab some realistic armors to spice up your load order with Realistic Armors 1K by 2 second. What I love most about these armors is the changes it made to the fur armors. Now I actually feel like I'm wearing fur armor and not some cross between hide and leather. I also love the mercenary armor as well, as I'm always playing a spell sword class and we are well known for being mercenaries for hire. It doesn't take but two seconds to realize how great these armors look and feel, and that's why I highly recommend downloading this mod and giving it a try for yourselves. Okay, so we just picked up some really warm fur armor, and that only took us about two seconds to do. So we're gonna need it for the Wintertime by Alan. <laughs> Wintertime by Alan is a really amazing mod because it does something I've never seen before. It layers all of Skyrim in a big blanket of snow. Now, you can combine this with Climates of Tamriel's Winter Edition, along with SFO Definitive Edition with Snowy Trees add-on, and you will be in for a Winter Wonderland takeover. Wintertime by Alan really makes Skyrim into what I thought lore-wise should have been. In fact, if you take a look at Daggerfall or Arena, Skyrim is known for being a snowy land-filled area. This is what you get with this mod, and I highly recommend giving this mod a try for yourselves and pairing this with another snow mod as well, because this mod will also use whatever snow texture you are using. Alright, that's going to be it for me today. I really hope you all enjoyed today's mod trilogy episode. Don't forget to check out our growing community Discord server for some good fun. Smash that like and subscribe button for more content like this. And just a heads up, I'm almost done with my Oblivion load order. Testing has been great so far, so I'm really excited for this. Until then, this has been another episode of my trilogy, and we'll see you in the next one.